much, thank you. <laughs> Hello, Montreal, you guys. Yes, thank you. It is so great to be here. I'm actually, I'm so excited to be in Canada because honestly, I was worried it was just a myth. <laughs> actually, if you're from Canada, where did your parents threaten to send you when you were bad? Is that, <laughs> my parents always said Canada. <laughs> So I am from the Midwestern United States, from St. Louis, Missouri, actually, yes. Go Blues, the ice hockey team there. And uh, the people in St. Louis are very friendly. In fact, my parents taught me to always introduce yourself by name. So I am Ellie, and uh, what is your name, ma'am? Sally. Sally, hi, Sally, I'm Ellie, good to meet you. And sir, what's your name? Joe. Joe, hello, Joe, I'm Ellie, good to meet you. What's your name, sir? Norman? Norman. I knew a Norman once. <laughs> I'm Ellie. It's good to meet you. <laughs> um, yeah, well, this is a big theater. <laughs> we have the place rented out till Sunday, so we'll be fine. Uh, Ma'am, what's your name? Shooty. Shooty? Shooty. I'm Ellie. It's great to meet you. Is there any chance everyone else is just named Claude? No? Just would make it go faster? Okay, all right. You know what, actually, I have an idea. Uh, just in keeping in mind time, how about on the count of three, everyone just shout out your name at once, okay? So one, two, three. <laughs> you all are named Claude. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I thought that. Um, well, it's great to meet all of you. And I am so happy to be here in Montreal at Just For Laughs. I mean, have you been out there? It's crazy out there. It's so wonderful. I do love French Canada, though. It's so beautiful here. I once went to Quebec City in February. It was gorgeous. I stood outside for more than two minutes, so now I can't bear children, but <laughs> it was beautiful, very pretty. But it's been a great year for me. We're about to start the second season of my show, Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. <laughs> Yay, thanks, guys. <laughs> nice of you. Thank you. I, I, I remember how excited I was when I learned I got the part. I told my mom, she asked me, what channel is it on? I said, well, oh, mom, it's not on TV, it's on the internet. She mailed me a check. <laughs> and I kept that check. And I'm very proud to say that the show was just nominated for seven Emmys. Yeah. Yeah. So, of course, I called my mom to tell her, and she asked if I'd worked on my acceptance speech. I told her, uh, well, that I wasn't personally nominated for my performance, but it's really, you know, it's more about the ensemble. So, she sent me another check. <laughs> it's fine. I get it, Mom, you have money, you know. Actually, my grandparents just told me that after hearing so many great things about the show, they're finally going to download YouTube. Good for them. The only thing that's been a slight adjustment is that now people think they know me because of the character that I play on the show. So Kimmy Schmidt is a very upbeat, positive person, and so am I. In fact, my agent tells me that being happy all of the time has kind of become my thing. <laughs> it's what people want from me, which I love, because I am a naturally happy person anyway, and if my happiness can make them happy, then it makes me happy, which makes them more happy, and that makes me even happier, which makes them also happier, and then we're all just so damn happy. <laughs> Okay. Here we go. It gives me joy to make all people happy. It gives me a warm feeling in my heart. I like to think that making people happy is in itself a gorgeous work of art. I like to play nice. a thought I like to keep at bay Cause basically we face eternal blackness So what's the fucking difference anyway? <laughs> On the other hand, life's too short not to be one big party You cannot get too deep down in the dark Until one day when I am driving my 
Windshield shatters into shards of glass. I kill a school bus full of preschool children. My skirt flies up to expose my bare ass. And as I lie there in the street half naked, a milk truck crushes my entire spine. But until that day, it gives me joy to make all people happy. It gives me a warm feeling in my heart. So enjoy yourself tonight and have a good time. Don't focus on the fact that you will die. And that these exit doors seem unusually narrow for a building that seems extremely flammable. I don't know, maybe that's just how they do it in Canada.